gypsies welcome back to my channel and happy friday good to be here good to have all of you guys here with me and hope everybody's having a fantastic friday so before i get started uh well let me just say i have a dollar tree haul i have shout outs that i have written down at home that i keep forgetting to bring my book when i get out so i do have shout outs to do so if you've asked me for a shout out i probably have it written down um, just remind me though um, in the comments if you've asked me and I haven't done it yet. Also, if you have sent me a picture of you in my merch and I haven't posted it, please let me know because um, <clears throat> I remember somebody saying like on one of our lives that um, have I posted their picture yet and sometimes I save them or sometimes I can't save them and I have to do a screenshot so some I might have missed one I don't want to miss any so if you've sent me pictures of yourself in any of my merch please let me know let me know how you send it so I can go back and look and if, if I haven't posted it yet so just want to say that also if you're not subscribed to my channel please I just want to remind you go ahead and hit that subscribe button leave me a thumbs up if you like this video when we're done and leave me some comments down below because I love to hear from you guys on what all I'm getting ready to haul so I found some good stuff yesterday I'm super excited um, I'm just gonna start I'm gonna start with the Boro guys I'm gonna start with the Boro you guys know I've got two packs of the lavender TP I know like sometimes I go and they don't have any at all so when I see that I grab it I just grab it up I still have a pretty good stock of TP I don't like going getting too low you know we just we just can't allow ourselves to get too low if you know what I mean you know like you never know when something's gonna happen and people's gonna go wild out there we don't want that anyway I'm gonna save this bag for last let me show you this so they had these this is fantastic oh my gosh I love this um, it's just basically a whoop. whoa baby it's BPA it says so right there and it just says water bottle it's huge let me see how much does it hold 48.8 ounces guys this is huge I love this I need to drink probably three of these a day for my weight because you're I'm not gonna say that nothing else but yes I need to drink three of these a day at least um, to make myself feel better you know I mean like stay hydrated I, I feel like I've been slacking on the water lately so of course I got this they also had a gray and a blue like um I didn't really care for the blue color. The gray was okay. It'd be really great for a guy. But yes, I'm just loving this. I love this teal color. And yeah, that was that was a good deal. I had not seen those yet. So I'm like, get in my buggy, baby. You check out check out this hair. Yeah. Didn't feel like doing much with it today. So I'm like, okay. Act like the queen ager you are and stick it up like that. Okay, you don't want to lay it there. That's fine. Let's we will get you up there. Okay, so I showed these the other day, and I grabbed me one more, because whenever I was there, I was thinking to myself, why didn't you get another one? Because this is so per this is so perfect for so many things, but I'm going to use this one right here to do um, lip glosses. You know how our lip glosses, I'm going to use this one for like lip glosses on my bathroom sink. I have more than a ton on my bathroom sink and then the other one I got I'm putting in my bathroom ca cabinet for like uh, like the hair bows that I really love like I've got clips I've got like really sparkly you know just different things that I really love that I don't want like Jack to get a hold of you know because it's like my faves so I'm going to put those in those up in the cabinet where she can't reach them so I just think that th this is going to fit there perfectly plus you can see through it it's wonderful plus look at it just look at it it's gorgeous so I was super thrilled that they weren't sold out I was afraid that they were gonna be so yes and then I saw this. I don't know if they've always had this. I love that this is a pump bottle. So this is the Lucky Super Soft, it says. Sea and Sun Aloe After Sun Gel. This is alcohol free and it's 12 fluid ounces. So it says cools and soothes 
moisturizes, help, helps minimize drying and peeling. I just do not remember seeing this product. Now, I know that they have had like aloe gel and stuff a lot, but I just do not remember seeing this one in the pump bottle. So, I think that's a really cool thing to have, especially in the summer. Who knows? I might need it later because I'm going to get out there with the water hose and I'm going to clean this bad boy. Okay? It needs it so bad. I want to get those tires and bumpers shining again and I just got to go for it. So, today is probably the coolest day we're going to have for a while. It does say it's 75. It's only supposed to be 71 today. So, I'm hoping it cools down some, but yeah. Anyway, I grabbed this right here. This is just the Pepto-Bismol, Pepto-Bismol, compared to Pepto-Bismol. I have never bought this from the Dollar Tree, but Jack's stomach hurts a lot, and honestly, it's probably stress from living at our house. Just saying, but <laughs> uh, just because, just, there's just, there's, strike that, reverse it. Um, anyway, her stomach does hurt a lot. But let me just say, when I was her age, I had an ulcer. Like, I had an ulcer, and I was on, like, prescription strength medication that I had to take. So, I don't know if it's just something, like, that runs in the family. Because my husband, when he was he was her age, he had an ulcer, too. He carried Pepto-Bismol to school with him. So, I'm like, you know what? Like, that is something that that is just, like, back then, they were allowed to do that. Now... Don't even try to send your kid to school with a bottle of Pepto-Bismol. Um, but anyway, it's it's the Ready and Case brand. So, I know that's a little bit better than the Dollar Tree brand. So, you get 118 milliliters, which is four fluid ounces. So, I'm just going to keep this for Jack, just for whenever she needs it. And then, um, they were out. Like, oh no, they weren't out. My husband loved those cars. Um trail mix. He absolutely loved them. He said, please get me some more of those. I said, okay, yeah, because I'm thinking, you know, they should have them. So, the one I got, the, uh, the place I got his was at um, Leicester Square Dollar Tree, and I'm like, okay, so the one in Beckley, surely they have them. They didn't. They did not have them. So, hopefully, I'll make it down to Leicester Square before they sold out, and I'll get him about five packs because he really loved that Cars, but I did grab him this because I know that this is something that the Dollar Tree usually always carries. Um, it doesn't expire until April of next year. It's the Island Choice Mountain Trail Mix. It just looked a lot like the one, you know, the cars, like as far as what's in it, it has peanuts, raisins, M&Ms. Um, it has like real M&Ms instead of just the chocolate candy pieces. So it might be just as good to him. Uh, almonds and cashews. So I'm going to give him this, see if he likes that. And then I could just start buying him that kind, you know, if when they run out of the cars. So grab that. I grab these for Fifi because this is one of my favorite eyelashes. Now these bad boys, when you have these on and it's windy, they are blowing in the wind. Like when we took the top T-tops off that day and went to Lewisburg, I was wearing these bad boys and I could just feel them blowing in the wind. That's so funny. They're so long. They're absolutely gorgeous. Uh, if you can even see them, they're kind of even curled. Like they are absolutely magnificent. So yes, I had to, I had to grab her some of these. I don't know, this might be a little bit much for her. We'll see, we'll see. Okay, and then I got these for my hubs. Um, they, I, I, I couldn't find Fruit Stripe or Kool-Aid gum, which, you know, is normally what I get him. So I got him these Airhead gums. This one is watermelon, this one's blue raspberry, and these are really good. So, yeah, I, that's a repurchase for me. I do purchase that some. Um, got this for Dee Dee. I don't know if they want her to have this. So, the pork ear that I got, um, she didn't give it to her. She said uh, she don't give her pork. So, I'm like, okay, I'll remember that. But this right here, I didn't know if, if she would give it to her or not. This is from Greenbrier. So, this is, um, this is a water buffalo steak bone. Dog chew. So, a water buffalo steak bone. So, I just grabbed that for Dee Dee just to see, you know, I don't know if they're going to give it to her or not, but uh, I'll learn, you know, what, what they'll give her and what they want, and then that way I just won't, won't buy the stuff she can't have anymore, right? 
Um, I just wanted to show you guys this. This is the LA's Totally Awesome. It is the window cleaner. And the reason I have this, for one, I need to clean my windows, but um, I asked for some tips on like cleaning glass top stoves. Um, I've got a lot of like burn on, you know, just, it just doesn't, I mean, even when I clean it and scrub it, like it's still, it'll probably never look like new, but I'm really hoping for it to look pretty good. But Michelle from, I think her name, her channel name is Adventures in Life and Keto. I think that's her channel name. She said that this stuff, just the plain blue window cleaner works really well so i'm like you know what i don't even have any of that so i thought i'd go ahead and pick this up like i said i do need to clean my windows i don't know how good this is for cleaning windows but i do need to clean my windows and i'm going to keep the rest of it just to wor work on my glass top stove so yes and then i got some more tattoos um by the way let me show you guys let's see if you can see can you see this this bad boy looks so real. Like, it looks, it really, it really does look so real. I know you can't really see it. But, like, it's still, like, boom, you know? It's still, it's still dark. It's supposed to last for up to three weeks. And let me just say, I, when I real, okay, so I got on the Shein website. Because if you remember, it was light. It was, like, almost non-existent. And then after, like, a couple of days, it was, like, you know, like a regular tattoo. I'm like, what is this? So I got on the website and looked and it was supposed to do that. So it says that when you put these on, make sure like not to get, get that, like, like lay your arm, you know, like if I put a tattoo right here and I went to sleep at night, like when I woke up the next day, it could be on my face for like three weeks. So you gotta be very careful about like sleeping. And I figured out that must be why I have a star up here. I must've had my arm bent dirt while I was sleeping and it just transferred over. So you gotta be careful. But I got on their website and I ordered me a bunch of tattoos. They have tattoo sleeves. They have moons. They have just all kinds of stuff. And I'm super excited. I can't wait to get that Shein haul. I'm going to show you guys. It's nothing but tattoos. So I'm going to have a blast. They even have tattoos like for men. I got my hubby one. Because we are wanting to put, get him a tattoo on this arm. A real one of course. But I thought, we, you know, we could just play around with that. See how he liked it. It's actually pretty cool. So anyway, I did grab some more of these. Just because I'm wanting to put them all over. Just like, see that girl on there. Just like that for the 4th of of July like this shirt would be really great because I could put them on my shoulders and stuff I probably have another shirt too but like I just thought I'd grab two more of these so you get two sheets I think in each one I think they're just alike so it's on the front and back so there's that one there and then this one here which I'm really digging so yeah I'm gonna load up for the 4th of July which is day after tomorrow wait a minute is it that blows my mind right there because I have still haven't planned a 4th of July get together. I bought all this stuff. Guys, I'm one of the worst. I will just say so myself. I'm one of the worst. Okay, so I've been seeing um, some people, I can't remember who, hauled these My Little Pony rings, okay? So they had two different ones. No, they didn't. They're all the same. Okay, never mind. Okay, see how there's... <laughs> who is that? Twinkle, Tweet. Um, it doesn't really matter, but <laughs> any other time, I totally know. Totally. But that's Pinkie Pie and Twilight Sparkle. Yeah. Wait. Twilight Sparkle, Pinkie Pie. And I was thinking these were two different ones. So I told Jack, we're only going to get two because they only have two. But they are the different on the back. So anyway, you get two surprise rings in here. So, which two rings will you get? So, they're really cute. So, I'm going to let her open those. I won't open them. And then, I did get three more. Maybe three. I was thinking I got four, but it could just be three more of these. Because she actually had a blast with these things. They're really, really cute trolls. And the sunglasses are adorbs so like we found the blue because we only had like the red orange and pink i think so we found some blue ones and a yellow one so i went ahead and got these and she wanted me to run back to the house and give her those like right in the middle so like soon as i 
showed them to you guys, stop the video, run back to the house, give them to her. I said, no way. Are you out of your mind? And then she said I was mean because I wouldn't do that. So, um, I grabbed two packs of Panasonic batteries. I got a double A. I got a triple A because I need them. I need them and I'm going to show you why here in a minute. Oh, oh. There went the aloe vera gel. Okay. Let me see. Let me just put that there. Is that an empty bag? What is this? Hold on. Hold up. Oh, that's the bag that's going to go. Okay, that's my last bag because it's good. I'm going to save my last bag because it's good. Okay, so I got this. I've been seeing these and I'm like, you know what? This is really cute. This is really cute. It's a flamingo. Look how sparkly the flamingo is. The pink pom-pom. Oh, it's so soft. It's just so cute. It is that skinny pin, you know, that is hard to write with and stuff, but I'll probably end up giving it to Jack anyway, but it's really, really cute. So I kept seeing them. I'm like, I have to grab one. I just have to grab one. And then, let's start right here. Um, Oh, I, I saw these. Well, first of all, for the batteries, I grabbed me this. Yeah, it's just, the, I've had these before. It's the little personalized fans, and they work, they work good. They work just fine. I mean, you know, you're not going to get, like, the windblown look from them or anything like that, but they do work just fine, if you can see. I, lo I, I like that. I love this light purple color. Um, I like to have this with me, like, beside where I sit because I get so many hot flashes guys it's ridiculous it's ridiculous but I just want to keep this like where I sit so like I can you know and I'm not sure you do have to have a screw to get this off um it takes two double a batteries so that's what I needed the batteries for so I was glad to see those back I get one every now and then and then who knows whatever happens to them so okay so I did find a couple different air fresheners. These are cool looking. Now they are driver's choice, so they're, you know they're not gonna be that great. They are dual, dual fragrance. So you get two different scents in here. So this one is the apple cinnamon. I'm getting ready to open it. I'm getting ready to put it in here. We're getting ready to check it out. This one's strawberry lemonade. So I'll probably hold off on that one until, um, until. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this one real quick just to see like what it's all about. See if I get any sense from it. So you have your little thing that you have to hook on here, which is not a not a problemo. Boom, already done. And then what you do is you can turn it from low to high. Can you see that right there? I'm gonna turn it all the way up because that's the way it needs to be. And then you just pull out or wait, what? Yeah, okay. Pull this out. You pull this out to release the scent. And now that smells good. It really does. Um, let me see. What kind did I say that was? Apple cinnamon. Apple cinnamon. Get that in the trash. Okay, so I'm going to put this right here in my little vent. My vent clip. Come here. Ah. Okay, so clipped in just fine. So I'm gonna turn it like right towards me so I can see if I get some scents. I do smell it. Okay, I smell it, so that's one good thing, right? Okay, and then I only got one of these. I don't really, Jack was with me. She's like, what is this? I said, I don't know, let's just get one. But since then I have seen, oh, I can't remember who put that together. Or who opened it? Who was that? Oh, I'm sorry. I watch a lot of you guys. Usually I'm cleaning or driving, so I can't comment, but I do watch. So I saw somebody open one of these and actually put it together. I'm not sure. But anyway, I grabbed one of those and Jack can open that and deal with that thing. So yeah. And then I saw this. I thought it was super cute, but wait a minute. Look, I have another one of these. This is New Car and Ocean Breeze. So, they're probably going to be a little bit of nothing, but I guess we will see for sure. Because I'm not getting like a strong, a strong, let me turn it up. Like, let me turn it up. Okay. Okay, I'm, got it. I got my air cranked. I'm 
basically it's blocking my air for one thing like the whole thing like blocks the air big time and I can't really get a whiff that makes me so mad the only thing I'm still smelling right now is this bad boy right here this is that car sense California sense Coronado cherry that thing is still smelling good guys you know it's been what a week a week this right here I moved over here it's the strawberry pound cake from Bath and Body Works when I want to smell this I take it down and smell it very seldom do I get a whiff of that so that cherry California car sense is the best that I've seen so yeah so I'm moving that stupid thing like what did I expect really though you know what did I expect totally okay let me show you guys this um, like me and Jack has been into the trolls so this is one of those like three in one sets I just thought this was kind of cool um, you get a puzzle you get a memory match game and you get dominoes so that's kind of cute I don't know like are the domino let me open it are the dominoes like real plastic dominoes just curious I just think this is really cute especially like if you do toys for tots or anything this would be a cute little thing to put in there because you get like three little things in one to do you know kids are needing stuff to do there's the dominoes they're not real plastic and then here is the memory match game so that's cute that's cute I love I, I just love the colorfulness and the looks of these honestly I have no idea how to play dominoes I have no clue never really played dominoes I had dominoes before never knew how to play them I don't know craziness okay so then I got these file folders I just thought they were super cute or actually super beautiful look at them look at these they're so pretty you know sometimes you just need a file folder to keep stuff in so I'm just really loving these we use mainly folders to put like Jack's homework or stuff like that you could use them for important papers or I used to have a filing cabinet that I kept stuff in and that was just a, another way to like hoard stuff I'd never needed like old bills that I already pay like power bills I just don't do that so anyway I got these for Jack just stuff to do you know it's summer like it's not like she's been in school anyway but you know there's always something for her needs to be done <laughs> so this is just like the little velvet art this is the lol and I just thought that was really cute so yeah it comes with the little thingies here and this is an lol too this is the um the 3d stickers so these are stickers and you color them and then you can stick them wherever you want to stick them preferably not my windows or you know anything like that and then this is a troll sticker one so I thought that might be fun for me and her to do together I think it's really cute so yeah that's the stuff to keep Jack busy and then last in this bag is a roll of washi tape which I thought was absolutely gorgeous it's just um, it's just from crafter square there's what it looks like can you see that it's just uh, to me it's like boho boho yeah yeah if you're taking shots when I say boho I'll try to help you out by saying boho more often okay so I don't take shots so somebody mentioned it. <laughs> that's the only reason why I said that because I say it a lot apparently <laughs> Okay, so there's that. Let me stick this back in there. Okay, so I don't think that I've showed you. This has been kind of floating around in my back seat. I don't think I had shown you guys this yet. This is just a starfish. I'm going to hang this on my front door. The one I got right now just will not stay. Like, every time I look at it, it's like lopsided and stuff. I feel like this one... Is not going to go lopsided I think it'll it'll pretty much hang straight and look good and I love that it's a starfish it says welcome and it's cute so I'm gonna go ahead and hang this there they still have some of their decor you know up up in the Dollar Tree right now for fall or for summer for summer okay so I grabbed these for my hubby he's almost out he might be out I'm not sure it's just the close-up dental picks you get 50 in here so I just get those occasionally for him here's something else I got for him 
yeah, sunflower seeds. So I'm like, you know, you might like these. This is, you get five ounces, which is pretty good. Low cholesterol, low sodium, a good source of fiber. Um, sunflower seeds are really good just to snack on. They're really good to throw on salads. Um, yeah, I just think that, the, that he might like these. I don't know if they're lightly salted. Yes, because it says the ingredients are basically roasted sunflower seeds and salt. So it says low sodium, so it must be lightly salted because it doesn't say at all. So it just said sunflowers kernels. These are from Island Choice as well, which I like that Island Choice. Like, is that, oh, it is a green briar. So Island Choice, yeah. I'm running out of room. Okay, you can go over there. Okay. And then I grabbed these because um, these are red sweet pepper strips, um, but it does say pimento. So is pimentos, okay, this is a stupid question, okay? Is red peppers pimentos? Because it says like pimento rojo and tiras. I know I butchered that. So sorry, but premium quality, but... Bellina's Gourmet Non-GMO Red Sweet Pepper Strips, but then I guess that's in Spanish, um, the pimento thing, so does that, I don't know, I don't know, that's stupid, oh, never mind, just overlook me right now, okay, but anyway, these are, um, I figured these would be good for a, look at that garlic in there, I think these would be good for a recipe, because I made a recipe a while back that called for these, basically, but it says, it said roasted, but red sweet, I would totally switch these out, so I thought I'd describe those just to see how they were, and then here's a, here's an, hold on, here's an item that's a Boro, roll, roll of paper towels, okay, so here's my most non-favorite thing I've ever bought at the Dollar Tree, okay, now you guys can tell me what you think about this, I mainly got this just to show you guys this. Now, they did have these baskets, you guys. We used them. We liked them, you know. But then they came out with these, okay? So, I got one. I got one. Okay, they're from Jot. They're the little collapsible, you know, just like the bins. But, okay. So, I don't like this product. I just don't. I feel like there's so many better things if you're thinking, oh, I'll put this in my drawer to keep things in, pencils or whatever. I just feel like there's so many nicer looking products out there that would do the job much better than this little old wrinkly, ugly looking case. Okay, there's my rant about this case. Yeah, so I just want to say, I don't like that product. I don't like the product at all. Okay, next, high chews, sweet and sour. So these are two of my son's favorite flavors. There's watermelon in here and there's grapefruit in here. So I'm gonna give these to him. They are um, immensely fruity, intensely chewy. Hot chew, sweet and sour. So it says true to life fruit flavor with a tangy twist and watermelon and grapefruit. Those, I mean, listen, they're not together. There's watermelon or grapefruit in here. I just feel like those two flavors are phenomenal anyway. I love everything watermelon and grapefruit as well. As a matter of fact, I'd like to try one of each just to see what they taste like. So yes, I'm gonna give these to him when we get home and I'm gonna make him give me one of each. Just so I can try it out. Yeah, we'll do it right here, but I don't want to torture you guys any. Now, I got some candles here, and I, I mainly got, I'm going to burn them. I'm going to burn them because I've been burning candles every single day. I'm trying to go through my supply of candles that I keep buying, but I mainly got these because they're cute. So, this one right here is called Karma. Yes, baby, Karma. It says frankincense and vanilla. Boom. Karma. Lightly scented, but let me just say it smells fantastic. I like the smell of that. So, Karma, you're, it's going down, baby. This one is Namaste, Namaste, Mahogany and Tea. 
once again, lightly scented, but smells amazing. And basically, I like these, like, right in between me and my husband. There's a table. He's on the bed. I'm in my chair, kicked back. Right in between us on the table, I will light one of these candles. Because the throw on these is so weak, you know how that goes? You know how that goes. That it's, it's not going to light up a whole room. But I'm thinking if I put it there, me and him will both, you know, get some scents out of it. And that smells like a man right there. It smells good. Okay, and then this one is Zen. So this is white ginger and amber. So it's just a really cute scent as well. I don't know how I smell about that. How I smell. <laughs> okay. I mean, I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> okay, wait a minute. I was trying to think of something that it reminded me of. I can't. I'm not sure how this is going to smell lit up. Zen might not be so zen, okay? I don't know. I don't know how I feel. And then I got one book. I'm not going to say that's the only book in here, but this book is the best from the best-selling author of My Husband's Wife. It's from Jane Corey, and it's called They Had a Bond. Well, it's called Blood Sisters. It says, They Had a Bond That Should Never Have Been Broken. Blood Sisters, a novel. So it says, Three little girls set off to school one sunny morning. Within an hour, one of them is dead. Three young girls, one accident, a lifetime of lies. It says, 15 years later, Kitty can't speak and has no memory of the accident that's to blame, but that doesn't keep her from being frightened when she encounters an eerily familiar face. This is going to be good. It said, here's some of the reviews. Gripping, intense, and masterfully created. Addictive. It'll keep you guessing until the very end. Boom, baby. Yes. I'm all about that. Yes, I was glad to find that. So that's going to be a good read right there. That's going to be a good read. Okay. La no, this is not the last. This is the last bag before the good bag. Can I just say that? And then this needs to go back here. I've been keeping this in my car to try to keep things organized. It ain't working. It's working a little bit. Let me just say it's working a little bit. Okay, so snacks for my son. Um, these are the Stacks Mesquite Barbecue. Boom. Okay. I got this because I don't know why. I liked it because it's like a miniature of the bigger ones. I love the blue lid, and I like that, that it has these handles, that it makes it easy to pick up. So I'm not really sure what I'm going to put in here. Um, if you have any ideas, let me know. I guess you could put sugar or whatever in these things. Um, I have a sugar dish, though, so a sugar canister. So I'm just not really sure what I'm going to put in there. i got tape on me from something. Who knows? But yes, so I grabbed it. I grabbed it. And then I got these for Jack. I got her some Play-Doh the other day. These are the crazy art softy dough this is elsa and anna from frozen 2 you get a mold and you get some play-doh so yeah you can make these two little girls she'll enjoy doing that and then they have these out which i've never seen these before i think these might be a name brand but let me look on the back because it'll probably say Greenbrier. <laughs> so these are both large they're, they're they are called ggs globalglove.com so i guess it's not a green bar it says the perfect glove comfortable high quality hand protection there's what that looks like so i got one for my son and one for my hubby um, just to keep in the toolbox they're always looking for gloves for some reason and i feel like these would be really like a good fit they look like a decent glove so i went ahead and grabbed two of those and then, oh, I have one more, one more of those little things, wherever I put the other ones, who knows. Oh, all right, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys this because I, oh, no, I had two more of those, honestly. So she's going to have six more to open, or is that five more to open? So I got this candle and I got more than one, okay, but I have not been able to get all three to, I think I got three, maybe four. I have not been able to get them all together at one time. The rest is probably in my back seat right now, honestly, 
honestly, right? I need a shirt that says honestly now. Um, but anyway, look at this boho vibe. Yes. That's a boho vibe if I ever saw one. First of all, you got your tassel. You got your tassel. You got a little wooden top. You got that wonderful print. Look at that. This is Prosecco and Rose. Another wonderful candle to burn. <sighs> yes. If you see these guys, pick them up. They smell phenomenal. They smell so good. They really do. So, can't wait to give that a whirl. Okay, let's get in to the good stuff, okay? First off, let me get over there. Oh my gosh, I'm never getting this stuff organized. Um, first off, I'm going to start out with these right here. These are makeup bags, and they are so cute. I'm like, look at these makeup bags. So, let me just say, before I start all of this, hold on, let me get these out of my way. Uh, before I go through all of this right here, I just want to say that I am already collecting stuff for my next beauty giveaway. I love to do the beauty giveaways because I am fortunate that my Dollar Tree does get some hard candy. Some of you guys' Dollar Tree rocks it out with a hard candy, okay? Some of you guys' Dollar Trees never get hard candy. Like, it's awful for you guys. I understand. Mine, kind of a mediocre Dollar Tree as far as hard candy. I do find some, okay? I never really find those, well, I guess I have those big pallets. Very rarely. But, like, whenever I do find stuff, I try to buy in bulk, you know, so at least I can do nice beauty giveaways and give the people that don't have get the hard candy a chance to actually win some. So, I'm working on my next one. But anyway, <laughs> these <coughs> it's just cosmetic bags <clears throat> let me turn that air down every time i find a really cute cosmetic bag i have to grab it i have to because look at this this is fed this is phenomenal this is mermaid look and see it's even got a mermaid tail it's even got a mermaid tail but they feel really good they're beautiful and then they have this one here which is just gorgeous look at that Look at the, and this is something, crown? I have no clue, let me know, is this a crown? But like, I don't know. I have no clue, but it's pretty. So I'm like, get in my buggy, you're going. And speaking of makeup bags, guys, I found the hard candy makeup bags. Yes, my friend Coretta, she shops at the same Dollar Trees that I shop. She sent me a message. Dollar Tree has those hard candy makeup bags. I'm like, I've got to go. Like, it was, it was, I think it was the evening time. So I was planning on going like in the morning, first thing. And I did. And they still had them. I think that was how it went. Um, but yes, look at the, first off, look how big. First off, look how big. Look how big. They are huge. They feel so good. So it says night out. So I don't know like like what the deal is. It says pat it says pattern inside. So that's cool. And then it says hard candy, soft touch cosmetic bag with expandable base or brush storage. So there's that. Okay, so you unzip the bag, which is pretty darn awesome. They even have a plastic thing over it just to keep it, you know, looking brand new. So you unzip the bag, you look inside, and you have this gorgeous, take that out, this gorgeous print inside, okay? That's not all. Let me just show you guys, okay? So you can ha have it like that, or look on the bottom. This is the bottom. There's another zipper. You unzip it. What just fell out? Did something fall out? It probably had one of those. Yeah. Okay. So you unzip it and you can store brushes in here, it says, or you can just make it into a bigger bag that will, you know, expand at the bottom so you can put more stuff in here. How awesome is that? I love that you can use it for storage. I don't feel like you can get a whole lot of brush storage in here you know you might put one brush in here if you wanted to but i like i like the thoughts of it being expandable so that's the best part of that like these are gorgeous they're so big 
I love these. So I got me one. I got me one. And then I got two extra ones to go to be put back for the giveaway, for the next beauty giveaway. I'm super excited to have found those. So that is one of the wonderful things that I found in there. And then, are you ready for this? I found these beauties. Would you look? OMG. Yes! I could not, this is all they had. They had three. They had three. I grabbed them all faster than you can say. Skin them or inky dinky dink. Okay? I grabbed them. So, it's top 10 eyeshadow collection. These are in Naturally Gorgeous. Can you see the sparkle? You probably cannot. There's leaves blowing in the background. It's kind of taking up some of the I don't know. These are gorgeous. I, I was too happy. I was so extremely happy. I'm like, yes. So, woo, baby. One for me, one for the giveaways. Yes. I'll have at least two winners, and it's according to when I do the giveaways as to how many more winners I have. I do have my receipt here. If you need the Fetch app info, let me know, guys. I will send it to you, and it will be in the description box. Okay, and then, let me show you what else I found. I hit it hard, I hit it fast. I was grabbing, I was growling. Okay? So these are hard candy. Glosstopia, yes please. So this is the ultimate shine with hyaluronic acid. Why? Is it too plump? I don't know. This is in the color Bronze Gem. So, there's what that looks like. And then the color is a bronze gem. I don't think that's coming through. But we are going to give it a whirl, girl. Okay, we're going to give it a whirl. Really quick like. Because I got one for me. Two for the giveaway. Yes! Super thrilled to find hard candy. I just get so excited and because Coretta told me that they had the hard candy bags I went straight to the hard candy or I went straight to the makeup like no ifs ands or buts Jack was with me I said we are going to the makeup section first she's like yes so anyway let me get let me I thought I got that off did I not hold on bear with me here yeah there we go Okay, these are nice, nice big old bottles. Mm. Don't really get a scent. So, there's what it looks like. Let me throw a little on. I do have a little stick on, but this is a gloss. So, what I have on is a matte. So, it's just going to make this glossy probably. Uh-huh. It does have a good flavor. Cupcakes, baby. So, basically, it's a gloss. It's almost, I mean, it just has very little of a tint to it. Let me, let me do a little, do a little. Okay. It just has very little bit of a tint. It's a beautiful tint, actually. It's gorgeous. I love that color. That's really, really pretty. Sometimes you don't want a big lip, a big lip color, or a bold lip color. You just want a little bit of a gloss, especially, ew, what is that? I don't know. Especially if you have a, a bolder eye going, which I always have a bolder eye and a bolder lip usually. But yeah, okay, two more things and I'm done. Now I only found one of these right here. Well, three more things. Um, let me get them all out really fast. Okay, so I only found one of these Wet n' Wilds. This is the Color Icon Eyeshadow. Eyeshadow. Like, what? Eyeshadow. Okay. Interesting. I don't know how I feel about that. It's interesting. And I want to give this a whirl. Okay? I don't know if I will. I don't know if I'm going to put it back for the giveaway. I'm not real sure, but they only had one. 
It's in the color Unicorn Glow. And it looks like Unicorn Glow. Like, totally. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. I love the Wet n Wild stuff that they've been having here lately. Like, it's been the bomb. This is another huge haul. Like, I don't know how I feel. Okay. So, then they had Sally Hansen nail polish. I'm like, what? Sally Hansen, like these, like these big old Sally Hansen. So I got two, I was going through them. They had a really pretty teal as well. I limited myself to only two. So I got these two colors here. I think they're both gorgeous. I mainly use nail polish on my toes, okay? So this color right here is called Scarlet Lacquer. And it doesn't really look red. It looks more of a melon coral. So, that's what color that is. And then this color here is called Grape Gatsby. Grape Gatsby. Now, that's a very light purple. Yeah. that That's really pretty. I really like that. So, yes, I love finding uh, Sally Hansen. You know, that stuff's expensive. It really is. So, that's a really great deal. Really great find. So, anyway, that is my haul. It's an extra large doozy of a haul. I'm just going to name it Doozy. Doozy of a haul. I don't know what I'll do. I don't know. Anyway, guys, I just want to say thank you for watching. I'm sorry that this was so long. I apologize for that. Um, I probably need to keep it around 30 minutes. You know, I know you guys have better things to do than sit there for 45 minutes and watch me show you stuff. So, I'll try to, I'll try to amp it down a little bit next time, okay? Um, anyway, I just want to say thank you guys. If you stayed to the end, yes, thank you so much. If you didn't stay to the end, thank you so much. Anyway, so give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. If you want the Fetch app, let me know and leave me a comment. Let me know whatevs. I don't know. Just let me know something. Just let me know, okay? All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye!